Hi everybody, welcome back. So, I've washed my hands and I need to rinse my bell pepper off. I don't have any green chilies, so I'm gonna put bell pepper in there and that'll be fine. It's gonna be delicious. forgot I set that down there and I'm like no, I wonder where that is I got a new rule out <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with me anyway so we're gonna do about uh, not that much maybe a little less than that we'll see this is loud <laughs> I'm going to cut it itsy bitsy. I think that's probably enough. I think so. Okay. I keep hearing this weird sound. I'm not sure what it is. Almost sounds like a a whale in the distance. Okay, so we're gonna put the filling right here in this pan. Okay, so back burner on about a five because it has a tendency to overheat. Normally I'd put it on a six. Put some olive oil in there. Put some onions. I have some onions in the chicken already, so not a lot in the pan. But a few more. Than what I put on the chicken. Okay. Okay. Six ounces of cream cheese. This is a block of eight ounces. And we're just gonna put the whole thing in there. Two more ounces, it's gonna make no difference, I don't think. What is the problem? Unbelievable, 
and then I touch it, I do like that, and it burns everything. It is what it is. I just have to deal with it until I move. I'm not going to fix it. I turned that work order in a week ago, over a week ago. Nine days ago, ten days ago. No, nine, nine days ago. Should have been done in three. I'm not going to do it. That's fine. Okay, quarter cup salsa. We're going to use a picante sauce for that. Still waiting for the stove to heat up. Quarter cup sour cream. I'm going to do a third cup because I think a quarter cup's not enough. Uh -oh. Now I gotta wash that. I really made a mess, didn't I? Unbelievable. It's just been my whole week's been going like this. Making messes, multiple messes a day. I'm so tired of cleaning up. Was it what, what I just spilled all over? I don't know. It seems like it's everywhere. But all right, we're gonna get um, this out of work. Uh, we're gonna put a little bit of salt and pepper in there. Don't trust it at all. Sour cream. We bought this little one for my husband's work when we were out. And then we bought a new one. And we bought another new one. <laughs> now we have open one of these and open one of these and this is what I'm finishing up. See, even a third of a cup doesn't seem like that much. But, it'll be fine. That's a third of a cup. Uh-oh. Don't fall. There you go. Oops. <laughs> and probably I'm going to crack a couple more clothes of garlic in there. I'm just going to use the thingy though.
Not to be plenty. Lower the heat on this. A little bit of the juices. Let's cool that down just a tad. Fight to cool it down, fight to heat it up. It's fine though. Alright, we're good right there. Okay, now we're going to put this in there. Put these in there, we're just going to put everything in there. Cook everything together. It'll be fine. Except for the chicken. I don't want the chicken overcooked. And it's cooked perfectly right now, so. Break in there. Again, that's the new one. Why am I doing that? Okay, so. Chili powder. Some cumin. Ooh, that cumin smells good. Garlic powder. Cream can go in. Put a little more of the juice in there. All right. Picante. Or salsa, and I'm gonna use the whole eight ounces of cream cheese. And I'm gonna move you over so you can watch. Good lord, Lisa, I had to do this. Sorry, I'm, I haven't been improving in anything lately, so here we are. How's that? Is that okay? I should have cut it up. My spatula is not working. Now I'm just making a mess. <laughs> It'll be fine. <laughs> um, <clears throat> I really wish I was better at this. I do. But lately, I've just not been better at this. Not at all. Not even a little bit. We're going to go in with the wooden spoon. Why not? Let's get this show on the road. Goodness gracious. Now I'm going to turn it up because I turned it so far down because it was boiling at medium. Should not be boiling on five. But it was, so I had to turn it down. And now I'm just wasting all this on my thingy. It's all right. There we go. So I'm going to continue to stir this 
cream cheese in, it'll soon start melting, I'm assuming. And it's going to be delicious. It really is. We can use a little cornstarch if we need to, to thicken it up. But I think we'll be fine once the chicken gets in there, saturates all this up. I'm going to put some cheese in there and cheese in the peas. a nice creamy cheese sauce for the ench enchiladas and the taquitos. I'm going to put it all in the sink. So the enchilada will have uh, enchilada sauce on it and the taquitos will be air fried. Totally two different tastes with the same filling. It'll be fine. There we go. Look at that. There we go. We're getting there. Okay, that is nice and thick. Just gonna let that cook for a minute. Don't want to get it too hot because it'll we don't want it to curdle. That's looking good. We can probably even put in a little more of this. Just a little bit at a time. Get it out just a tad. Whatever, when we put the chicken in there, then we'll know for sure. And put it on a three, it'll boil and burn. See, it's starting to steam. I turned it down. Now it's starting to steam. That's awesome. Mmm. That's good. more salt and pepper. Definitely taste the um, green peppers in there, which is good, I think. And now we're going to add A little bit of cilantro, a bit of fresh cilantro there. I want to say not that much. Get this rinsed. Wet, don't matter. Fold it, roll it, cut it once. I'm going to go once that way. That might be a little too much, but we'll see. I say cut it once and I cut it more than once. That's okay. You're not supposed to cut it more than once, but it's a hard habit to get out of. <laughs> okay. That cilantro in there is going to be so good. Mm. Yes. Yes, indeed. And it's still pretty thick, so I'm going to add just a little bit more of that. I think it's thickening up fine on its own. I don't think we'll need the cornstarch, because I don't like cornstarch anyways, but this looks good. Okay, so it looks thick enough. All right. Now we're going to add the chicken. Then we're going to start rolling, and that'll be all good. I'm going to let it just kind of sit for a minute so I can clean up this mess and then we'll get the chicken in there and then I'll have everything ready to roll up. <laughs> 